All right, so good morning, good night, good afternoon, everyone. So I just want to let y'all know I'm going to the Whaling Museum. So this is a nautical theory video. So this video is this nautical theory, and we're going to learn the history of whaling in Long Island. I'll be going to Nantucket as well, and other whaling museums as well. So this is the first time I'll be filming in a maritime museum. So therefore, um, I hope you guys enjoy the exhibits, the history, and what people have to offer. So. I'll see you guys inside.
smell this. I don't smell anything. Oh man, I'm afraid to smell this. smell anything.
second and and that's like one of the three that has uh, um teeth um the right whale the orca which is the killer whale and the sperm whale they have teeth so um every other whale doesn't have teeth so it's it's really amazing to me it's absolutely an amazing thing that i get the chance to see the whaling museum and it's really cool i, I try to film everything as much as possible and have you guys look at everything as much as possible so I, I, I try to, to condense everything as much as possible. And, um, and I'm glad for this ending. So 
as this video is going to end, I want you guys to enjoy this whole view. So, I want you guys to enjoy that pelican over there, that's, that seagull over there, and the egret over there too as well. So, and um, it's a beautiful, it's a beautiful, beautiful beach out here. It really is. So, this is like, I think Covent Park. Um, I'll put a description down below so you guys can visit. So, or you guys who come from out of state, to New York State, you guys know where to go. So, look at this video and I'll put everything in the description below. That is a fact. So, thank you guys for subscribing, liking, and sharing. And my experience with the Long Island Maritime Museum, um, Cold Spring Harbor, um, Whaling Museum of Education, was a great experience. I would love to work there. To be honest with you, I would love to be employed there and be volunteer. Makes sense. Like all in amazement is the actual word for it. And I learned so much though. And I appreciate people of my color, people who people who look like me. I, I appreciate them for making bigger profits of the whaling and the maritime business, the merchant and whaling business. People of my ancestry has made a profit. We made a triple profit. We caught more whales, crabs, lobsters, and all that stuff than our Caucasian counterparts or European counterparts. They did work too, but but the the, the indigenous people, people of Hispanic and Afro-Hispanic, and people of African Americans, Caribbean Americans, because I'm Caribbean American, um, we contributed so much to their industry that the business owner's smiles went like this. Wow. And um, but also whales are a beautiful creature. I don't encourage poaching whales. I don't encourage that because we need whales for the economy. We need whales for the ecosystem. And uh, I'm going to try to join like oceanic organizations that starts promoting that. That starts promoting like illegally poaching whales and other animals that 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 violates merit that violates maritime law so i'm gonna end this video like this i know i said it before but i just like talking like this i like talking at the beach i like talking at this at this um, harbor i really do it's, it's a beautiful thing man it really is so i'm gonna let you guys enjoy this for a few seconds and like, share, comment, subscribe to my channel. And thank you for liking everything.